I'm driving down um, towards Cold Spring Harbor, Huntington, where I used to live. And as I drive down, there is a sign that says right there, it says all American city, Cold Spring Harbor and Huntington. I was like, that is absolutely amazing that they've earned that level of acknowledgement. I didn't see that the last time that I came down this way. Um, and there's where the water was. This is the drive from when I was a kid. Now, I came down um, today and I am, it's November 18th, 2022. So, um, part of Linda and Lois's history is after they left, um, the premier location, um, in Roslyn, they opened the office in Cold Spring Harbor at Three Harbor Road. I did not realize that the corner was Elm and Three Harbor Road. I had no idea the realization of the ELM. Um, across the street here from Three Harbor Road is where one evening James Russell introduced himself to me. Um, apparently it says, uh, it has a placard across the way. I just had to slow down and look at it and I'll go pull it up. It says Israel and then it says Ketchum. Uh, K-E-T-C-H-U-M. I'm not quite sure what the linguistics translates out to. Um, but that would be where um, we went for a walk um, and we had a discussion and it overlooked the water um, and there were a car full of people um, that were over in the dirt parking lot and I don't even remember how I got looped into that conversation or into that meeting. Um, but I know that it's relevant. I know it happened once. And I know it's part of the history of this area. Um, also, it's just really interesting that all of a sudden now, it says that Huntington was at the top sign and then Cold Spring Harbor was on the lower part of the sign and All American um, was in the center, which they've never really displayed before. So. I'm gonna get out of the car and I'm just going to look for the signage that I, as a kid, now it makes more sense. But this is that old whaling town that I grew up in. So the corner it says Cold Spring Harbor Fire Department. Old Elm, Old Harbor, and that's the park across the street. There's the flag, and there's that sign. And this is where my parents worked for a while. It's now the color sage green. But it was a different color, I believe. It wasn't painted when they worked there. It was more, it was the regular color when they worked there. Together. It's Starwind 978, Starwind 278, 
so interesting that he made one of our scars in his broken. And it's based on station. Well, actually, I don't know if it's Glen Harbor. I don't know about it. It's really close to Glen Harbor and Hamilton, which is 11724.